In this tutorial, we are going to talk about how to write an app which gets two numbers and then it displays the sum of the two numbers. The algorithm to do this one is we start, we get the first number, we get the second number, then we are going to assign sum, a variable, to be equal to num1 plus num2, and then we are going to display the sum, and that ends the app. app. So let's go ahead and start writing the code. Again, the first thing we do after we sign in into App Inventor, we're going to go to Projects and start a new project. Let's call this one Sum of Two Numbers. Click OK. Now, again, the first thing we do is the title here, we're going to change it to sum of two numbers. Obviously, we need to get two numbers from the user. As, as usual, we need a label and a text box. And to do that one, we need a layout, a horizontal arrangement. So you can put the label and the text box beside each other. So let's drag and drop one horizontal arrangement let's set the width to be field parent now let's go to user interface bring a label and drop it inside change the name to first number first number. <clears throat> now we are going to drag and drop a text box beside it and we need rename the text box because we use the text box inside the program to number one. Now we do exactly the same thing for the second number. So we go to layout horizontal arrangement, change the width to fill parent, now again a label, and this time we're going to change it to second number, and we drag and drop another text box beside it, and we need to rename it to number two. <clears throat> the last thing we need is a button. And then we change the text to process or anything you like. Now to display the sum of the two numbers, we also need a notifier. So we drag and drop a notifier on the screen. That's all we, we need to design the user interface. Now we go to the programming part. And we want as soon as we click on the button to start summing. So we are going to go to our button. Click on the button and then when the button is clicked, do. If you remember the algorithm, the sum of the two numbers goes to a variable called sum. So we need a variable here. To create a variable, we go to variables and then we initialize a global variable. We call it sum. Initially, we will set it to zero. So this will create a variable in the program called sum 
with the initial value equal to zero. Now, as soon as we click on the button, we want to add the content of number one and number two together. So we have to set the variable sum. So we go to variables again, and this time we get the set block. Now we say global sum, and then we want to add. So we go to math block. And as you can see, there are so many different blocks here. The one that we're looking for is the addition block. So we drag and drop over here. <coughs> And we want to get the content of number one and number two text boxes. So we click on number one. We drag one of these out and change this guy to text. Before we put it back here, we duplicate it and change this one to number two. So it's number one plus number two. So we found the sum. Now we have to display it. To display the sum, we go to notifier. Again, we go down and we get the show message dialog here. The message is the value of the sum. So we go again to variables, get and then sum. Now the title of the dialog, we want to say adding two numbers and also the message on the button, we want to say OK. Now we are all ready to test our app to do that one again remember you go to connect and then you click on emulator but i have already started my emulator and i'm ready to check my code now <clears throat> as you can see this is the design of my app so the first number Let's say I want to add 10 and 20. The sum has to be 30. And you can see that the sum is 30, 